amanya gange nze sonko muhammadi omulimi asangu we rutente mu kalungi district Uganda okuva abani kisasi guru ni webajja ne bampa system ene ya amazi era ndi musanyu fungo budde buno okuva ntandi sojiko zesa mm, nali ni mayika 10 ne kati na yongera kwa ni mayika 10 na mukaga ne yikezo banyamba zona bazitaka kama there we have a smaller reservoir mm. and a smaller pump mm. Okay. So the design is in a way that as water comes in, it gets out. Nexus Green uh, is privileged to partner with uh, DripTech India, a subsidiary of Jain Irrigation. Through that, we have got access to advanced technology in irrigation, which is uh, laser spray irrigation. This laser spray is more efficient as compared to sprinkler irrigation and water saving. It works like rain, very quick and uh, also evenly. The distribution uniformity is very high. I am Gautam Das from DripTech India. We are grateful to Nexus Green to make us their irrigation partner for a great project. What is the benef benefit that you have got when you, after you started using this laser spray? What is your experience? Mm. Era went and so called the Sanyok sing. Chirunjin Chiraban to Rare over the Buno. When bad denga Mfukida Catin Fukida of Kiriziwano, Sinabak take a missent as a machi, Zamafta. A Catia Rare when you know when you know Kuchida Vida Kusizon Yeno. Quam Sanaka Guatan so quack of Vowena Symbias in a yan. Mfukida now one wound the system away. Zen Cosessa. He's just started using the system for this season and you know the rains have been on, now the dry season has just started. But before, when he was doing this, right now he would have spent money on fuel, for irrigating, labor, for the people who are watering, and that's money he has not yet spent. When the system came to him, he was already growing his oh. crops, but they were midway. Oh. Yeah, so he, he just completed the, oh. the, the, the season with, with the irrigation, but also it rained. So he did not, he couldn't not ascertain rain. the benefit okay. of irrigation okay. in the last season. Uh, but now, uh, since he planted, yeah. he has been irrigating. It yeah, has not yeah, rained. Yeah. Well, how much labor he used to use earlier? Is there any saving in labor for irrigation? Now, now for me, I'm, I, don't, I don't have any labor working mm -hmm. on this system. I'm only working myself. And before? Before huh? I was like, like it we was like a twenty. Twenty before. Oh, okay. mm. Mm. Yeah. I was a good thing. 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 I Bango call your collar with the Nakuna, and go moon to a mobile video collachi. Bama look for Kedida. This is uh, nine meters. Oh my God. Mm. So we do nine to take care of the friction losses along we the way. We take the. Mm. And, and now a garden like the other one is a bit up. Oh. So some of them will compensate. Oh. So it is able to be irrigated. How long you run this? How many minutes? I think here that means or oh, sixty. Hmm? I put sixty minutes. One hour. One hour. One hour. Because it now it is too much dry. Mm. Hmm. Actually, even our calculation is around an hour because of the precipitation rate okay. and the precipitation rate of the soil. Okay. Yeah. We found the laser spray tapes an easy to uh, install technology. And it's also quick to install. Once we start the trenching and then we punch the pipes, 
Within no time, the entire garden is filled up with the laser spray tapes. It's easy to train for the farmers in terms of uh, maintenance, how to roll them away when they are working or digging, and then how to spread them out again when they need to irrigate their land. So we find that it's a user-friendly technology, and we encourage that this should be adopted across the country and even across the region. Design has been done very, very thoroughly. The execution, that is installation of the testing, has been done by the books. Everything is being done very, very thoroughly in very, very systematic and disciplined manner. And the farmers have been also well trained. The few farmers that uh, have benefited from th this project, they are very excited. Every time we engage them, they are very excited and they are so cooperative. Most of them have become very active farmers since we have put our system on their farms and they are hoping for the best. And most of them are saying we, th this laser spray tapes has, in has increased their productivity. This is passion fruit. Oh, this is passion fruit. Mm. So this is for for his colleague, uh -huh. who is also benefiting. But his is that one. You're going to see how good it is. It's okay. neat, of course. Mm. Mm. What I'm seeing in the ground here is absolutely impressive. I have not seen anything like this before. A developmental project is being implemented with almost military precision. It is a very good system. It, uh, it is good also for the farmers who don't believe in drip because they are not seeing water. They can now see it through laser spray because water comes out and then drops on the soils when they are seeing. And it is, they are fine droplets so they won't harm crops. So it is generally a good system that uh, we are happy to associate and install in our projects. From the river, how does the swamp comes? This thing? Water is just in the swamp. Uh, I mean, the, from the ground level, it is just. Yeah, it so is because it is low. Yes. It is, huh? So this one now is. Uh, there are springs everywhere, and also recharges from different oh, places. Oh. Yeah. So it, it finds oh its way. Yeah. So much natural water. Mm. So the swamp, the swamp has water basically in it. And this is a solar. This the one. Yes. This thing, uh, so the cable supplies power. power. Mm. Yeah. It's, it's submersible. Yes, yeah. so the pump is inside, sends water through this pipe, power goes in. Mm -hmm. yeah, there's a dry run sensor also in, in that black cable. Like now it has been raining, just the rains have just subsided. Mm. That's why it's muddy, because there's been a lot of turbulence. Mm. Yeah, but sometimes you come and it's just Clear, settled. Almost. Yeah. Also swamps, you know, they are naturally uh, filtration systems. Mm, I see. Water goes through, uh, through them, uh -huh. and then by the time it reaches the other end, uh. it has dropped whatever it was carrying. I see. Yeah, so they filter. When water is passing through that vegetation, oh, and okay. the root system and all that, uh -huh. so the swamp takes part, then the other continues flowing as springs, oh. as springs up to here, oh. when it fills up, and then now for also from here to the pump, we also do some filtration through a pack mm. of aggregates, mm. stones, and then to the yeah. pump. Beautiful. Really green all places. Mm. And I wanted to ask how much time you used to take earlier for irrigating? How much time? And now how much you take for this five hectare? Almost uh, to finish them, which is like uh, two weeks. <laughs> to, to move okay, around. To nice move around. And make sure every part, yeah, every part is okay. It means the first one you started with is yeah. already dry. If I, mm. I, I end, Super I get dry. back. Yeah. And you find them dry. Yeah. And now? And now, I know. I think two days. Oh. And when the sun is on, I can take like a 95 per day. I miss a small part. 95%? Yeah. I am thoroughly impressed by this. And we pledge our wholehearted support for this project. In DripTech, our mission is to take the drip irrigation technology and our laser punch drip technology in particular to the farmers out in the developing world. We are grateful for being chosen as the irrigation partner in this project. It's going to be a game-changing technology, especially here in Uganda, where we are among the first to introduce it, and it is going to 
to be able to save farmers a lot of money and labor costs and time and everything. So thank you DripTech and uh, as Nexus Green we are happy to be your partners and uh, we look forward to more relationship with us.